Texas pecan season right around the corner and to talk about how our recent weather has affected production. Joining me today is Larry Stun, a horticulturist. So Larry, talk to me about pecan season. Good, bad, what are the projections? Cools off in the fall and typically that's when our pecans start to mature and ripen and indeed the early season varieties are starting to get ripe and we have a few growers already starting to harvest. It's been a challenging summer though, as you well know, it, the drought exceptional so growers you know have had to struggle to keep their trees watered and the drought is even hurting some of the trees so it's been a tough season so the pecan is the only native nut tree that we have in texas and so it's native along the rivers and creeks and so we estimate there's probably a hundred thousand acres of native pecans in texas typically what you have is you have a big crop one year the trees exhaust the reserves and then the next year, the crop is off. And so the better you take care of your trees, the less the up and down. Here we had a fairly large crop, and then we had the drought, so the trees didn't store their reserves as well as they should. And so we have a lot of people that are off this year that have little to no crop. And so it's a combination of crop the previous year as well as current weather conditions. That's interesting. So not only do we kind of come in with a little bit of a disadvantage that drought and likely that La Nina, you know, further oh, production. Yeah. It's horrible. It's horrible right now. So, you know, we thought we were getting better. We got a little bit of rain, but it's turned off back to the same. It was. What are the ideal conditions for pecan trees? What do, how do they thrive? Well, so like I said, they're native to the rivers and creeks. So they like deep soil, like 23 feet of soil typically is what, we'd like to have. They like to have an inch of water a week and they like, they like the temperatures to cool down. So out West, out West, the trees do better because in the evenings it cools down. Whereas in the central part of the state, we typically don't cool off. And so that's a big disadvantage to us. So they like sunshine. It's a sun loving crop. And as long as you have water, the trees do quite well. So when they're stressed, when you don't have rain, it's that deep soil that carries them through. And so that's why you see trees grow along the rivers and creeks, because that's the very best soil.